Hey everyone, I hope you all are safe and doing good. So in the series of learning C++ programming language, in the previous video we have seen some member functions on strings, right? So theory part on strings is clear, like we have discussed C style strings and C++ strings, member functions on strings and all. Now we will do one coding exercise based on strings. You have done those member function and all, so I hope you can do this easily, right? It's a simple one. Now, uh, what we have is, we, you have a name, full name like Jayanti Khatri, right? But there is no space between this first name and last name. So you have to reformat it to, you know, read it more easily. What should be the output? Jayanti space Khatri. Okay. Now what you have to do, see, you have to, uh, you know, remember some points. First thing what you have to do is, you have to declare and initialize a variable like first name you can take or any variable you can take from this variable from this given string variable full name right how to initialize this thing we have discussed in previous videos so you have to you know re uh, revise those videos those things first right next thing what you have to do now in the next part you have to take another variable another string variable last name and you have to initialize this last name using substring method so in the first name you will fetch jenti from full name in the sub uh, second in the last name using uh, substring you will fetch only khatri right then you will conc concatenate this f name and l name using plus operator but obviously this would be same as this if you will concatenate both jenti and, and khatri like first name and last name so you have to insert a space between Jayanti and Khatri using, using insert member function. You have to use insert this function to insert a space between Jayanti and Khatri, right? See, there are many ways to do this thing. It's very simple, but you have to perform these tasks to achieve the formatted full name, right? So pause the video and try this out. So let's create a new file. I hope you have done this. So first we'll take a string variable uh, full name, right? And here we have any name you can take, right? Let's take, we have Jenny's lectures. So this is not obviously it's not readable there should be a space between first and last name like Jenny's space lectures right so you have to reformat it okay first point what we need to do you have to take a variable first name this variable sorry and we will initialize this from the variable full name full name right but in first name, what you want? Only Jenny's, right? So what is the method? You just write down the string variable name from where you want to initialize this, that is full name. And here, start index, from where you want to initialize. The first character from where you want to take, from which position, from which index, so from zero. And next would be the length, how many characters you want to fetch. So length would be, till s this s so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so 0 and length should be 7 right so if you want to check out then you can just print this f name and you can check whether in in this name you have jenny's or not see let's run this and see jenny's right Okay, it's, it is working fine. Now comment out this thing. Now second variable uh, name we will take that as L name <coughs> or last name. And we will use here substring. Here we will fetch from this string we will fetch lectures only, right? So that we can do with substring. So name of the that string variable full name dot we will call, sorry, not full, it's full name full name dot 
एस यू बी एस टी आर एंड हियर यू नीड टू गिव फर्स्ट टू आर्ग्यूमेंट फर्स्ट वुड बी सेम द स्टार्ट इंडेक्स एंड नेक्स्ट वुड बी लेंथ सो स्टार्ट इंडेक्स फ्रॉम एल आई वॉन्ट टू एक्सट्रैक्ट द स्ट्रिंग सो लेक्चर सो द पोजिशन ऑफ एल इज जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन Start index. Index is seven. Index start from seven. Uh, sorry, from zero. So L is on seventh index. And now next length. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight characters are there in lecture. So I eight character I want to fetch. So this substring, substring I want to fetch from full name from this string. So if you want to check out, you can check out here rather than F name. We can print. last name so it will print khatri sorry lectures lectures right now concatenate f name and this so let's take another variable uh formatted full name right we have a string variable formatted full name so now formatted full name equal to f name plus l name just concatenate but no it will not give you the desired result because if you now print the for this formatted full name let's run the and see what output you are getting it's jenny's lectures without space so what's the use of doing these things because as it is this unformatted name we are getting so insert a space first so how to insert we have an insert function you have to use that thing right we can concatenate also like plus and here we can do something like this space then plus l name this will work fine let me run this and show you see with space you got it but no 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 you don't have to do this thing you have to use insert function right so in formatted full name this name formatted full name i want to insert let's call insert function at which position you want to insert only one like a space i want to insert so first we need to give the position position where from which index from uh, at which position so 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 right seventh position so it will insert just before this whatever character at the seventh position here just before that character it will insert whatever you will insert so at 7 right now the character in this string is l so just before this l it will insert whatever you want to insert and i want to insert only a space so just give a space here and that's it right we can insert a complete substring substring also or a single character like we are inserting only space here this insert we can use in many ways multiple ways i hope you have done this right so please try out these functions now let's print this formatted full name and see jenny's space lectures right sorry so i guess this was simple one but if you didn't get it take your time and then again watch this video try to understand what we are using try to understand first what is this substr what is this insert how to use these things what does this initialization means right we are initializing this variable from another string okay So I hope you got this exercise. Uh, in the next video, we will see what are functions in C++. So now I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye bye. Take care.